Howdy y'all, it's Kentucky Ranger with a special Sunday, Sunday, Sunday edition. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday! That's right, I'm going to do one of these because I just had to. This one is going to be Medical Aid Edition. Or First Aid Edition, however you want to look at it. This is Aid. Hello. He's going to show us how to perform first aid. And this is Bob. Bob is the unluckiest guy in the world. Blabby. You will see why. Anyhow. <clears throat> That's another thing. Anyhow. I'm not going to say anyway. I'm going to say anyhow. Somebody brought that to my attention the other day. I say anyway too much. <laughs> anyhow. <laughs> Bite me. What do we have first? Well, here we go. The first item up, Westcott Titanium Bonded. Titanium Bonded Scissors. Titanium. Says right there titanium bonded blades are 3x harder than steel. Stay shop a longer and left or right handed, it doesn't matter to them. Westcott titanium bonded blades are three times harder than untreated stainless steel blades. Westcott use a process that bonds titanium to stainless steel core to produce a sharper, more durable, and longer lasting cutting edge. These scissors will stay sharp and smooth cutting for years, making them exceptional value. Like all Westcott products, five year war five year warranty? You gotta be kidding me. Wow. This product is warranted all to be free from all defects, workmanship, period, state of the package, contain limitations, apply. Hey, look, they even have an 800 number. Well, that's better than the address for the stupid popcorn. <laughs> if you don't know what I'm talking about, watch episode three. You'll know all about the popcorn. Anyhow, let's... <laughs> you like that? Anyhow, not anyway. Well, hey, they fit. Yeah, yeah, not too bad. Let's see how they how they cut cardboard. That's all I need to worry about. Ooh, they cut. They cut these scissors. They cut really pretty good. Yeah, not too bad. Westcott, the makers of fine cutlery for however many years. I don't know. There we go. Westcott. Anyway, I like that. Titanium bonded. Whatever that means. I don't know. Titanium is an alloy. How do you bond titanium to what? Aluminum? <laughs> I don't know. So let's let's get on. Well no, wait a minute. Before we get on to the next thing. Something I presented this yesterday the little fan couldn't get it to work and I'm like what's wrong with it well, what was wrong is this plastic part it somehow becomes separated because if you remember I, I even tried to put it together I don't know I guess I, I was on the heavy doses of Benadryl yesterday so I, I, I guess <laughs> I guess I dropped the ball. I don't know. But anyway, now that I got it... Uh-oh. Hang on. Anyhow. I fixed it. And now, it still has the govern... Where you can not You can only twist it so fast. Ooh. Oh, this is a nice breeze. 
you can actually get a pretty good breeze blowing. Candy still sucks, but you can it, it works now, okay? So I'll cut them some slack. I'm not cutting the popcorn any slack because it's in the garbage can outside and it's staying out there. Anyway, it don't work too bad. It's a dollar. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to paint it. I'm going to take the candy out. I'm going to take all these stupid stickers off. That's another thing. I didn't get this into focus yesterday. Was uh, or it says on here. Maybe I read that wrong. Let me see. Let me. No, it says right there. Flavor, flavor. See where it says fla flavor. Blue one, yellow five, and yellow six. What do colors have to do with flavor? I still don't understand that. Somebody explain that to me. Anyway, <laughs> sorry. Anyhow. Let's move on to something else. When I did my when I did my bucket of boogers, I was so excited about those that uh, when I, because they, they came in a packet this this package like it. So when I took it off, I didn't realize it said something on here. There's a disclaimer. Do not place in mouth or nose. Do not eat. Keep away from heat. I don't know why. May stick or stain some surfaces. If necessary, remove excess wash with hot water and white vinegar and store container and what I'm not use. I remember, that's another thing, once I finally taught my mom to get me this stuff and I chased my sister around the house, some of it got on the carpet and it wouldn't come out. It would not come out. It was shag carpet, but still, I, I just, I thought that was funny and I don't, I don't know I, I, I guess because I was uh, under the influence of uh, Benadryl, I didn't see that. So anyway, <laughs> I thought that was funny. <laughs> so uh, oh, let's 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 just move on. Can we move on? Okay, we got the scissors. All right. So what are we gonna have next? Let's get all this out of the way. Next. I know this. What does this have to do with first aid? Well, scissors for cutting bandages, right? Cut some. Cut, cut, cut. Next, you got to see when you're filling out medical forms. So, why not? An LED mini desk lamp style book light. LED style desk lamp style. So it's in the style of a desk lamp. Manipule del D lecture del yeah, whatever. Ugh. It takes three 1.5 volt AG alkaline equivalent, blah blah blah. Tiny, I like that. Tiny retro style desk style. It clips on your book. It sits on your desk. I don't know where it would clip. And here we go. Mini lamp, Dell, Dave, Dave, whatever. Oh, okay. It takes a little button. That's why it takes three. I was like, how are you going to fit three 1.5 batteries? And. 1.5 volt batteries in there. Okay, I see how it is. It's three little button cells. Open lamp cover. And do all this. Oh, ain't that cool? Battery manufacturer date August of 2015. That's well, been a while. I don't know if that really means anything. Manufactured batteries manufactured by Lixian. Batteries best by used by two, two, oh, two, uh oh, uh oh. Best used by February of 2016. Wah, wah, wah. Warning do not mix used batteries. Okay, we get that. Advertisements, uh, non positive. 
people or whatever. Let's see what this thing looks like. Well, we see what it looks like. There's the lamp. Lampy del Pestado. Well, that's pretty good. Well, wait a minute. That's, that's weighted pretty good, but I don't see any clips. Wait a minute. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's see. Stamp. Let's see. It says right here tiny retro desk lamp style. It clips on your book, it sits on your desk. Well, I can see where it sits on your desk. There ain't no way to clip this thing on your book. We clip. I don't see any clips. That's kind of cool. <laughs> oh, there. Oh, okay. There it is. There's the clip. Clip on your book. Whatever. <clears throat> anyway, look at that. Ain't that cool? Let me dim the lights. And let's turn it on. Whoa, look at that. Well, ain't that cute? It's, it's, it lights up. It's like a little desk lamp. Look at that. It almost reminds me of the little Pixar light. Oh, it's the other way, isn't it? Uh-oh, that part don't, <laughs> that part don't move. This part does, though. It's like a little Pixar, little Pixar light. <laughs> That's pretty cute. Okay, whoops. Here's my little desk light. Let's get the buggers and everything out of the way. Out of the way. Out of the way. Oh, now. Oh, it's the food portion of our show. What do we have? God knows. The first aid portion of the show. What do we have here? We have Baker's Bat. Almanite. Almanette. Almanette cookies. Almanite cookies. Yeah, sure, why not? Let me turn my light back on. I gotta have some light here. There we go. Best if used September 15th. Uh oh. I better eat them quick. They're just about done. <laughs> September 25th, 2016. Whoa. Better get them out of here fast. Ingredients stuff that's in cookies. Oh, contains egg and wheat. Here we go again with the nutrition. Who cares? Saturated fat? Who cares? It's their cookies. They're stupid cookies. Calories. 70 calories per cookie. Well, <laughs> ain't that cool. Baker's Batch. Net white. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, hey, look at this. Made in USA. Made in USA. Made in USA. Oh, look at this. You can even like them on Facebook. Let's see. Facebook.com. Traditional baking. Hey. Bloomington, California. Hey. It's something for a dollar. It's from the U.S. of A. Ain't it? Well, i am got to get into these. Got to, got to, got to. Got to, got to, got to. Ooh. Maybe I shouldn't have ripped so far. I'm going to have to store these. I ain't going to. What is that on there? What's oh, uh, some kind of shiny? It's a shiny happy cookie. Shiny, happy okay, well, here we go. Mm. 
Om nom nom nom. Mm. 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 That's not bad. That's pretty good. Mmm. Hang on. Hang on a second. Hang on a second. I just want to take another cookie. I'm going to have another cookie. Mmm, 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 mmm. Wow. Mmm. Mmm. For a dollar? They don't even have that weird funky dollar store warehouse taste. You ever you ever bought stuff like this, cookies and stuff, and they have like a an aftertaste that, that, that tastes like an old warehouse smells? These are actually pretty fresh. And there is that little almond little little almond after taking and there's no there's nothing no bad oh my god these these would really be good with coffee or tea oh mm, mm, i gotta save them oh my lord it's good my pal i want to eat another one but if i do i'm never going to get this video done and i knew it i ripped i was a little too uh oh Okay. We've got to, we've got to, y'all got to visit them on Facebook. Visit and like us on Facebook. I sure am. Traditional Baking Incorporated, Bloomington, California. I'm going to tell you something right now, folks. A dollar for a pack of cookies like this. Mmm. Oh. I tell you what, they kind of, they have a taste. Have you ever had pecan sandies? It's kind of that almondy. I mean, it's like a nutty. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. Oh, Lord have mercy. I'll tell you what we got next. Now that I've had cookies and I got cookie stuff on my fingers, I need to wash my fingers off. So what are we gonna do? <clears throat> Here's where the first aid comes in. I don't know what antibacterial hand wipes. Emoji antibacterial hand wipes. Look at that. Ah, Lord, he's like, oh, I've got chemicals on my fingers. What I thought was cool is antibacterial hand wipes with emojis on them I thought, well, how cool is that it's even got a little clip on it so now we got shoot take them out your factory sealed for our protection how do we ow how do you How do you get them out of that? Stupid. Oh, ouch. There we go. We'll use our titanium scissors. Oh, there we go. Oh, I can't wait for this. This is so cool. You get an emoji with each hand wipe. I thought, yay! Yay! There we go. Yay! Emoji with every wipe. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What's going on? What? Uh, what? I'm going to wipe my hands, but still. Oh, there's no emoji. It says emoji and a bacterial hand wipes. It says that right there, right there on the box. Pirate Bob and 
There's the one I'm feeling right now. Sad. Sad emoji. There's no 30 count. There's no there's no emoji on it. <laughs> Try it one time. Emoji! I don't see an emoji, do you? Oh. What happened to the emojis? I want an emoji on there. Jerks. When accuracy counts and you only have a dollar, where are you going to go? Who are you going to call? Who are you going to go to? You're going to go to the dollar place. Why? Here's why. Dun dun dun. Yes, yes, you're not seeing things. Results in three minutes. Three, oh Lord have mercy. Assured pregnancy test. I thought I'd seen it all at a dollar place. But this, this takes the cake. One dollar pregnancy test. Easy to use, quick results. This is what I, I liked right here compare to EPT <laughs> last time I checked even EPT is like eight bucks and you know that's the cheapest of the cheap <laughs> I, do, I swear to God I swear I'm not lying I got this from a dollar store and the reason I won't tell you why is because when I was there looking around for goofy crap to put on my stupid videos there was a couple, a young couple, and uh, they were in the aisle. Where <laughs> they were in the aisle, I found found my little. Where'd they go? My little. These 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 stupid little things. Where I found these. They were in the same aisle because it's the healthcare aisle. So anyway, believe it or not, I know you're not gonna believe. <laughs> I can't believe it either. Oh, Lord. He was arguing with her because the pregnancy test was a dollar. And he didn't want to spend a dollar. He didn't want to spend a dollar on the stupid pregnancy test. You've got to be kidding me. Hello? He, She was like, Honey, it's only a dollar, and I, I'm not supposed to, you know, and I, I don't make a habit of overhearing people's uh, conversations, but she's like, but honey, it's only a dollar. He, well, that's a dollar that I can spend on a six-pack of beer. And I'm like, oh, no, I almost bought it for her. In fact, I almost beat the guy in the head with the stupid pregnancy test box and said, you know, honey, this is... Please, I, it's like a stray kitten. I wanted to bring her home. I swear, it's just like, oh my god, please. And uh, I got to walking around. I got to thinking. So I went back a day or two later. And said, there's no way. Well, guess what? Yes, there is a way. Granted, that's only one test. You only get one test for a dollar. Okay, but still, assured. Whatever that's supposed to mean. Come on. Focus, you stupid, cheap old camera. <clears throat> and need I say anything right there? Do I really need to? Please read carefully. <laughs> Please, for the love of God, read carefully. You've got to read this very carefully before, before using this test. Test instructions. Collect some sample on a clean, dry glass or plastic cup okay oh in not on what was this in yeah in okay in oh, i was gonna say on lord have mercy 
Remove testing device from sealed foil pouch. I thought you did this in the stream. I thought you could pee on it. Well, the, apparently this one you got a you, you you've got a you've got a pee in a cup. <laughs> and if you're gonna use a glass one, please make sure you clean it before you feed your other kids. Use dropper provided to collect urine. Oh, whew, they give you a dropper, but you still have to pee in a cup or a glass container, which you're going to use for your other five kids for orange juice. Read test results in three minutes. Do not read result after five minutes. Wow. <laughs> this is like specific. <laughs> It's like put the pee in a pee in a glass pee in a glass vessel. Take the eyedropper, drop it on here. Wait three minutes, no longer than three minutes. Don't read after five. After five minutes, forget it. It doesn't count. It's no and void after five minutes. So what are we looking for? We are looking for. Result window. Urine dropper collection well. Well, well, well. And what do we have? Okay, here we go. Negative is one line across the C. Positive is across the C and the T. Invalid, nothing happens. Invalid, one line across the T. Distributed by Greenbrier International. Volvo Park. <laughs> Volvo. <laughs> I sure I can't believe this. A one dollar pregnancy. <laughs> oh my God! Our youth, our youth. Is, uh, please, y'all, practice some abstinence. This is ridiculous. I tell you what. And whoever that dude is, let's call him Pete. <laughs> Just because. <laughs> Pete. It's apropos. Pete. <laughs> and if you don't have a dollar for a pregnancy test and you have a girlfriend, which is so hard to believe, she was cute too. Oh, so sad. Anyway, let's see if this works. Hang on. A few moments later. Three minutes and not more than five. And as you can see here, I'm not pregnant. <laughs> honey, <laughs> honey, good news or bad news. I don't know whichever one you want to look at. I'm not pregnant. I'm not a Mr. Mom. I'm pregnant. But nah, it, I'm sure it has to do with female hormones. Anyway, I'm sorry about it. Anyway. Anyhow, sorry about that. But like I was saying before, Lord have mercy, if, if you're the girl who, uh, I seen it at the, at the oh, do I need to tell where it's at? The Dollar Tree? Uh, and you see this video? Please run away from him. He ain't worth it. If he can't afford a dollar for a pregnancy test, stop. Stop, stop, stop. Like I said before, I want to take you in. It's, you're like a stray kitten I, and, and raise you like I did my daughter and, and try to teach you that jerks like this you've got to run away from. I've been dating Steve for a month. Watch this. I have like, I have, I come up with ideas and set scenery. I have to build the whole thing from scratch. You get into a whole thing. Cause guys, just so you know, like from the second we start dating you, we keep tabs on everything you do wrong. <laughs> like everything to be used at a later date against you in whatever way we see fit. Cause it's like, cause we can get away with it. Cause girls are batshit crazy. And we stun our prey just so you know. We'll, we're really mean, and then we like do a Jedi mind trick, and we're just like really sweet, and then you're just like, oh, and then, and that's a bang. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Dollar store pregnancy test. I don't even know. I'd say even if, even if you're an actual gal, uh, I wouldn't, tr would not trust it. God, I wouldn't trust it. What I should have done is waited till my wife got home from work, had her try it. 
at least at least I would have seen if it would have come up negative because I'm pretty sure she's not pregnant anyway but anyhow uh, that being said that's that with that my uh, my little fan I'd keep it definitely I'm, oh yeah it actually blows pretty good now and uh, I'll tell you something right now people who might comment and say well you're so stupid and this is the dumbest thing I've ever seen it's not meant to be smart it's not meant to be intelligent it's dollar store crap it's meant to be stupid it's meant to not be anything other than funny uh, but I'm keeping my I'm keeping my boogers I'm keeping my fan uh, my little desk lamp. <laughs> That's so cute. My little desk lamp. Nope. Lost my silica gel. Not that I'm going to keep it or anything. Emoji wipes. I'll keep them, even though I'm awfully depressed because they don't have emojis printed on each wipe. They're still wipes. Lord, you ought to see the facial recognition on my camera. It is going crazy. Anyway. Anyhow, oh, I gotta stop that. Anyhow, these, well, you're gonna have to watch episode three. I'm not giving that away. You're just gonna have to watch. And uh, my scissors, hey, these are cool. And the things that I cut, I figure for a dollar, I messed these up, no big deal. See these here? <laughs> And uh, Office Depot, and it's so sad, they closed here about a couple weeks ago. But anyway, uh, nice pair of scissors, and uh, I paid not a whole bunch, but I paid quite a bit for them. Well, I've used them to the point they, they're worthless. They aren't hardly cut anything anymore. But these, they're fresh, hey. And for a dollar, if I mess them up, <laughs> I'll just go buy another pair. No big deal. And uh, any any who's uh, throwing these. Oh, definitely. I am definitely, definitely keeping these. Huh. In fact, I want to have another. Hmm. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Hmm. They really are good. Honestly, they are really good. So, I'm gonna put them on. I'm gonna keep them away from this, my pregnancy stuff. Let me get. Let me just put that. Let me put this away. And nobody pregnant. Uh oh. I see more writing on the inside. Any diagnostic procedure, self testing kit, blah, blah, blah. In other words, what that says is even though you paid a dollar and we're selling this as a pregnancy test, don't uh, negative results are expected in healthy, non-pregnant women. <laughs> no kidding. Oh my God, no kidding. Consult your physician. Yeah, that's exactly what you need to do. First of all, keep your legs crossed. In fact... My mama told me a long time ago, you know what the best source of birth control is? You take a bare aspirin, put it between your knees, and keep it there. That being said, God bless, and y'all have a good rest of your Sunday. Goodbye.